Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for standing by. Welcome to the Product Management View webinar series. During the presentation, all participants will be in a listen-only mode. If you'd like to ask a question during the presentation, please use the chat feature located in the lower left corner of your screen. If you need to reach an operator at any time, please press star zero. As a reminder, this conference is being recorded Wednesday, April 13, 2011. I would now like to turn the conference over to Val. Please go ahead. Thanks, Myra. <clears throat> to those participating through ReadyTalk, Twitter, and those who will be reviewing the webinar as a podcast or flash presentation later, hello. I'd like to welcome you to this new session of the Product Management View series. I'm Val Workman from Lima Technology Solutions, one of the sponsors of this webinar. And if you'd like to present uh, in this webinar series or propose a topic, feel free to start a discussion within the Grand View and uh, realize that the PMV is all about distributing the shared experiences of members within our product, open product management community. And today, as a result of your participation, the PMV is the world's largest free repository of product management recordings. It's my pleasure to welcome back Sai here, and he'll be presenting today's webinar, which is part one of a two-part series on we-centric leadership, which isn't really we as in the little thinking. For those who will be using Twitter, you can follow and add additional conversation and questions using the Twitter hashtag pound PMV during this webinar and continue conversation about this webinar on Grandview Community Blog and Grandview at LinkedIn afterwards. I'd encourage you to make comments and ask additional questions to size posting as well. I'll also be collecting questions throughout the presentation to address during the question and answer session at the end of this webinar about quarter to uh, the hour. Please feel free to send your questions and comments to me in the chat session at the bottom left corner of the Ready Talk interface, and we'll try to respond to them today. I'm going to pass the controller now to Sai to kick off this uh, presentation on we centric leadership. Sai, welcome back. Thank you so much, Val. It's great to be uh, with you, and, and thank you so much, folks, for, for joining. Uh, as Val said, definitely this is focused on uh, we centric leadership and creating we. And uh, my contact information is uh, there on the first slide. Also, my WordPress uh, blog is available by all means, so please feel free to visit. Uh, I'm involved with the Culture Sync community and the Tribal Leadership community, and I'm also involved with the Creating We community likewise. So this kind of really begins to merge a few of the topics that we've talked uh, about before on other webinars, which are available, as Val said, throughout the community uh, download and website. And most definitely, this brings in a, a, another vantage point here. Just a little bit more about kind of my background and, and the things that I'm involved with. My main interest is really uh, product management and a practitioner within the product management space, as well as the organizational health and transformation world. I really work with organizations to help them achieve and become their best selves. And every organization is unique as every individual. I like to classify myself as a student of the practice, so always looking forward to learning and, and experiencing things together throughout the journey. I do work with both the business side of the house as well as the technology side of the house, uh, definitely on the, on the ground floor in the trenches, and most definitely with, with management and leadership teams in really achieving that greater health. When we take a look at sort of this topic specifically, creating we, and, and sort of how it now begins to fold into some of the things we've talked about before and, and where this takes us. This two-part webinar series is really going to build off of some of the tribal leadership conversations that we've already had. And uh, I will actually bring in some of the tribal leadership aspects here and connect it to what creating we brings forward and see the overlap and touch points and really leveraging these two facets together. If you sort of ask me, hey, why are you talking about creating We Your Tribal Leadership? Over the years in, in working with organizations in transformation, these have been fundamental tools. They're not fundamental tools in the sense that I walk in the door and say, hey, let's do tribal leadership or creating We, but rather how do we address the needs that need to be addressed from a product management perspective, from a product development perspective, and really deliver greater value and think about the investments we're making relative to our products and, and the value that we're delivering to our clients. So to kind of just dive right in, and, and again, as Val said, please feel free to share uh, questions that we'll get to at the tail end. But to kind of just dive right in, there's 
a real fundamental aspect that we're all experiencing, and that is a degree of chaos that is surrounding us.